Hideyoshi, or known as Hide, is Kaneki's best friend since childhood. He did not give up on Kaneki even when he became a ghoul. Kaneki tries to hide it only to find out that Hide already knows about it. Here are the lists for Tokyo Ghoul Very Smart, Hideyoshi Nagachika. When Kaneki was announced missing, he decided to join CCG, in hoping that CCG can probably find info for Kaneki. He used to joke that Rabbit died of loneliness. When Kaneki avoided him, possibly in order to protect him, Kaneki cries when he sees his best friend again, and stated that he was lonely without him, to which Hide laughs and asks whether he is a rabbit. On the manga, Hide was seen approaching Kaneki, however, it remains a mystery whether Kaneki killed him in his half-mad and half-starved state, or was it only Kaneki's hallucination that he sees his best friend on the seaward? On the anime, however, his fate is sealed. He was seen being carried by Kaneki at the end of Fruit A, lifeless. He was pronounced dead on the anime, while on the manga, his fate was still unknown. On the very first chapter, Hide and Kaneki discuss ghouls over coffee. They both drew what they think ghouls look like. Kaneki draws something that looked like Rize, while Hide jokingly draws Kaneki, which should probably be a hint that Kaneki will be turning to a ghoul with Rize. Tuka was normally violent and will show her strong side. However, she too has a vulnerable side, and she only show it to those she trusts. That side also shows up whenever she was surprised. That was the case of Hide asking her multiple questions to which she does not know how to react and just goes away. In the anime, he was fatally wounded by Noro, but he still managed to reunite with Kaneki one last time before dying of his wounds. There is a similarity on how he did die with how Ukina dies. Both of them are important person to one. Both of them died in the arms of the person they trust. He knows when Kaneki is lying. He even told the secret to Tuka. He stated that Kaneki touches his chin whenever he is being evasive or attempting to lie. That mannerism was from his mother. He then enjoys bugging and tailing anyone he finds suspicious. When he tails Yamamori, he discovers the existence of Ogiri and he reported it to CCG. When he officially joins them as an intern, he gets promoted to an assistant in the investigation department because of his great intuition. He usually acts like a fool, but was actually clever. He was able to pass through an area with high concentration of ghouls. He steals a clothing of a dead ghoul so he can mask his scent, not being able to smell by other ghouls. Maruda was shocked that the mystery informant they've been looking for for the past six months was actually working as an intern, and that was Hide. He was the one who tipped CCG the location of Akiri's base. Hide was a complete mystery on Tokyo Ghoul. We only know that he is a childhood friend of Kaneki and he was cheerful and also smart. But his past was never revealed, not even in flashbacks. Could be that because he died early on the series or he has a major plot in the upcoming one. Well, let me know in the comments below on what you think why his past are never really brought up considering his connection to Kaneki. Tokyo Ghoul has popularity poll that occurs on 2014. Even though he has little airtime or exposure, he still landed in the fourth place in that popularity poll. According to his profile, he likes to listen to western music. He is also fond of cute girls and likes to eat steak. Hidi was referenced to the tarot card number one, which is the magician. His voice actor had auditioned for the role of Kaneki. Towards the end when there was 3 minutes left, he was asked to act as he was suffering. He didn't get the role of Kaneki, however, the staff stated that he will play Hide instead. 
He was responsible of discovering the Washu clan's true species. He gave the information to Marude, to which Marude investigates the clan and uncovers its secrets. Hide was cautious of Nishiki. He stated that Nishiki was poisonous to be around. It could be that he know what Nishiki or it's just his intuition. Nishiki was also cautious about him and sees him as dangerous to be around since he might uncover Kaneki's personality as a ghoul. In Tokyo Gold Crump, he was the ace of spades. Peace out.